Hello YouTube. We're here again with a Plato 90T uneven fire. Brand new engine, just running in. So I'm not rubbing it too much. You just want to let it idle a little bit. First tank of fuel going through. As you can see, it still have a little bit rough idle. Car fuel is going up and down. This setup is with one sensor. Here is ignition with two magnets and a uneven fire ignition. This is a special mode ignition for B type engine or a flat flame agitator uneven fire. The ordinary ignition will not work today. Sorry, the ordinary twin ignition will not work. To do it for your Sato 90 twin, your Sato 100 twin, and the 182 flat twin. All those will need this setup. Or if you're using the original twin ignition, you will need two sensors and one magnet in the magnet ring to get it working. But this one is a more simple setup. The magnets are ready. All you do, you just put your fuel in and go. This is the original carburetor on this engine. Um, what I find, those engines that have the two carburetors together, uh, this is my third engine in the paper range I'm testing with the original carburetor. And I find it works brilliantly. So, no need to change that out. Take a uh, like evolution carburetor on that, it's no need. Carburetor is well good for gasoline. That's 20 to 1 mix, I'm running with that. The oil I'm using is Redline to show pressing oil. I've been using that for a few years now. As you can see, the eye line is still up and down a bit. I will run a couple tanks of fuel straight before I able to rub it out I will make another video to see what the RPM I'm getting I think the prop on that is the Master Air Screw 14 by 8 or 6 one of them when I do stop it I will do identify the size that is prop and the RPM that I get from the top so as well if you're looking for a kit for your uneven fire engine and the 100 and the 182 plus twin. There will be a couple links in the description so you can click on them to take it straight to my page or my good buddy in Florida, Adrian. Alright then, the next video will be when I run it at top RPM and